us brothers. Let's hope for luck, man. Okay? So go on. Go on. This is, uh, this is verse 3 again. It says, Therefore, when there shall be earthquakes and uproars of the people in the world, then shalt thou well understand that the Most High spake of those things. Right. He spoke of those things. This is like we brought out Isaiah 42 and 46, that before he does things, he tells you. Yeah. Right, he, lets you he lets you know the signs to watch out for it. All right, get out Matthew 24 and 32 real quick, Avadia. Uh, it says fig tree. And 32. Uh, Matthew's 24 and 30. Now, nah, you should, you should really know. No, you know what? Uh, get a, before you get that, uh, get a, uh, start at, um, uh, what did the disciples ask when it's a shot of time? Matthew's 24 and 1. And Matthew's 24 and 1. Yahweh shot went out and departed from the temple. Right. And his disciples came to him for to show him the buildings of the temple. And Yahweh Shai said unto them, See ye now all these things. Verily I say unto you, There shall not be left near one stone upon another that shall not be overthrown. All right, it's talking about 7 AD with the um, Flavian dynasty, yeah. with Vespasian, Titus, the yeah. mission. All right, when Titus came and besieged, um, besieged Jerusalem. Yeah. All right, go ahead. And the Lord prophesied unto our people that the kingdom would be taken by violence. Same thing we're doing. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's right. As he sat upon the Mount yeah, of Olives. Yeah, the guy that Edomite's like, yeah, good job. Yeah, if you you probably give us a thumbs down or a middle finger when we tell you ask going to fucking slavery. <laughs> Sloppy, go ahead. The disciples came to him privately saying, tell us, when shall these things be? And what shall be the sign of thy coming? They wanted to know. All right, they want, they want to know when you're going to establish righteous rulership on earth. When are you going to establish your kingdom, my Lord? All right, go ahead. And of the end of the world, and Yahweh Shai answered and said unto them, Take heed that no man deceive you, for many shall come in my name, saying, I am a Mashiach, yep. Christ. You got a lot of people saying that they're chosen from the Lord to teach his word. You know, this is why you got a lot of false prophets. You got a lot of dumb dogs that are not barking not doing what they're supposed to be doing all right yeah but you got a lot even 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 with uh even even you got even got people that say that they're that they're messiah yeah. all right you got people that actually like to say that oh i'm the lord you know hey, for the longest while you had a guy saying you know he was the god said comforter yep. you know what happened to him you know he ended up going went hey. back to the school yeah i wish i said that the comforter would never leave you yeah he was he gone all right yeah. Go ahead. But back in, uh, I was just mentioned about 70 AD, they besieged Jerusalem, man. Yep. Had them surrounded, and they starved them out. Yes. They was eating, what? Eating everything, belts and all that. I mean, that, it was famine and all that. We had to flee. They fled to the Masada Mountains. Like, the same thing. They got they got us surrounded as a people. Jerusalem is a people for it as a place. They got, uh, uh, what do you call it, uh, checkpoints everywhere. This whole system was designed by the uh, the, the system. Giant apartment building. Yeah, yeah, so they know the ins and outs, the dead ends. They know where they got us surrounded. Yeah, they, but they already know how to. They already know how exactly. to shut this place down. They already know. They but, already know. But we depending on the Most High. Yeah. We we trapped in the matrix. We ain't got no way out. And they're gonna do it fast too. Yep. Yeah. Like like I was at the park. And, uh, remember the park we used to go to? Yeah. Every Saturday. Yeah. yeah, I was there just chilling. And all of a sudden, I see fucking fire come out. Right. Big fire. I'm like, shit, I'm gonna go home. I'm gonna leave. Now I left and then they already shut down the whole goddamn goddamn block, man. It's so easy to shut it off. You see protests going on, blocks already yep. shut, shut off. Already. All right, he already knows how to shut this place. He knows what streets. All right, you know, he already knows, man. He already got it all planned out. That's you think he... that he's just gonna, uh, when, when it says one man shall desire to go into a city and should not be able to think, just he's not gonna come out of his ass. No, he already has yep. it planned out. He already has. Yep. The streets that he's gonna shut down, man. All yeah. right. That's why it says in the book of Ecclesiastes uh, how there's no new thing under the sun. You know, this is the revised Roman Empire. You yeah. know, they're gonna use you know the same you know tactics more or less you know in a revised type of way. Right. Yeah. 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 Hey, they're gonna stop trucks from uh, uh, coming into. Yeah. Uh, we, we stop the grocery stores. Yeah. yeah. All right. Exactly. This is where all that three-day worth of uh, food supplies gonna come out in, a, in a, probably like, like in an hour, man. 
Because they're gonna have when all hell breaks loose, gonna have people that are gonna rush to these stores. Hey, Alright, they're gonna rush to these stores and they're gonna take every fucking thing. They're not gonna care. We're gonna have motherfuckers taking ten packs of water bottles and you got someone that don't even got you. You know, and what you think is gonna happen, man? Like the lake, you remember when the trucks had to pass through the garrison? Oh yep. Yep. Or oh. they could bring in meat or whatever it was. Yes, and then the uh, the people uh uh they, they killed the driver and took everything. Yeah. You know, you're gonna have that, you know yeah. you know. It showed you that in Venezuela, man. Um, the poor was that couldn't afford the food or, 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 or still in these trucks. Yeah. And they became, then it wasn't cannibalism out there? Somebody chewing on another person's ear and shit. Yeah, see. Oh, oh, uh, oh, that, that, that might have been somewhere else, though. So. Yeah. Uh, that, was, that, was, that was fake. Yeah, that was fake. Yeah. But that's what's going to happen. Yeah, though. but stuff, yeah. Uh, yeah, stuff like that's been happening. Yeah. And it shall deceive many. Do you want me to jump to the... No, keep going. Stop Verse... at earthquakes. Verse 6. And he shall hear of wars and rumors of wars. Hey, there's a rumor right now that Russia may invade Ukraine. That's why you have Ukrainian citizens trying to get out the, get out of the dodge, the man. You got Ukraine asking for the U.S. for help. You got you got U.S. Um, sending uh, uh, warships to the Black Sea. And even with China, too. Yeah. There's a rumor going on with China how China may invade ta Taiwan. All right, and, and, and the tensions are high. You know, Taiwan is asking for the U.S. government for help. You got uh, France, you have uh, Germany, you have the U.K. They're also sending warships over there yes. to the to the China Sea, where in Taiwan at Taiwan Sea, okay? Because the, that's rumor, there's rumors of war, but where's the war gonna take place in the Middle East? All right, well, eventually the Lord is gonna gather all these nations into the Middle East, man, yep. and judge them. But don't be surprised if you have other skirmishes and other battles and other places too all right because you got you got uh you got uh, over there in atlanta you got the russians setting up a uh, shop all right they got their uh the spot they got certain bases like they're they're, they're assigned to do different things like one bases are assigned to control and to give uh coordinates to the, the submarines all right the, the, the nuclear sub the nuclear submarines man all right you got you got wars and women's wars all right get that in uh can you get that uh no, no. Ezekiel 725, real quick. You also had uh, the European nations, they sent out a big uh, warship to go over there to do drills. You know? Oh, no, 726. It's the book of Ezekiel 726. It says, mischief shall come upon mischief. I think that mischief. Like it. Oh, my bad. Yeah, 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 yeah. Mischief uh, goes back to uh, destruction. Let me double check real quick. All right, we'll continue on. God. Mischief, mischief shall come upon mischief, and rumor shall be upon rumor. All right. Now, that's what you see right now. We're seeing uh, rumors of wars. We're seeing of how, how, uh, how uh, Russia... You know, uh, uh, they invade Ukraine, they even invade this place. Yeah. You got, you got a bunch of rumors going on right now, man. Yeah. All right, but you got to, the spirit got to work with you to know what's rumors true because you got a lot of false rumors as well. Mm -hmm. All right. Yeah. And you, and you also have Russia making bases in uninhabitable uh, places yeah, no, like but, Arda. Yeah, yeah. Antarctica. They got like 21 bases, I think. Getting closer to America, you yeah. know. Damn, this new this 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 goddamn uh, new update they did with the player is kind of yes, it's kind of off, it's way off. Like, 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 like I'm looking for mischief, isn't it? Yeah. but it means yeah, it means destruction. Yeah, like you no know, disaster. Yeah, it's ruined disaster. Yeah. So you can have one thing happening upon another, man. You mentioned it's like uh, Amos, where it says a uh, uh, a line you shall escape a line, and a bear met you. You're yeah. gonna have a bunch of. This, the, this disaster is gonna happen upon disaster, a bunch of yeah. destruction. You have things happen upon another, man. Mm -hmm. You don't think that y'all think 2020 was bad? Just wait, what the Lord's gonna do? Exactly. All right. Uh, you call. Uh, you, you said the Valley of Decisions. These people that's uh, that always been in the news uh, concerning these prophetic times. They NATO's always been in the news. UK, you know, always been in the news. Iran, always been in the news. You know. So most high been brewing these people up for you. These these nations for a while man yep. you know the valley of the, the armageddon that's what people 
uh, are, are preparing for. I mean, you know, those those most high steering and in a spirit to prepare for that time. I remember uh, when uh, uh, Russia got in, was it Russia? Well, I remember we was having problems with Iran, they called it, they was trying to call it the Armageddon, but it wasn't time yet. But it's about to be time, man, you know? And the, and the Persian, they, yeah, the Persians are Iran, that's in the Bible, it's prophetic, man. Yeah. You know? So, when we, when you talk, when you hear all those, that Brexit, and all that, uh, the, uh, what is some of the ones you named? French, and the, um, and Germany and all that, yeah. when they in the news, man, we, that, those are those people, man, that it talks about in the scriptures. That's how you know we close. Oh, no, 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 better, better yet, when you hear Israel, yeah, Israel. Right now, Israel is the least of the fuck, and they're going to draw this country, America, into a World War III to invade our, to invade our land. They're going to uh -huh. cause this. It's going to yeah. be them. Yeah. All right? Gonna, Israel is going to be the reason why this war took off, because they have problems with Iran. And we all know who backs up Israel, America. Exactly. All right? But that's a big prophecy. Russia and Iran, that's a big prophecy. And we're seeing them on the news. Tensions between Russia and America are not good right now. The thing about it is you fucking people don't understand. You don't know what's going on. Minds, your, your, your mind is so far gone, you don't you don't understand what the Russians are doing. You don't understand that they can invade this place, and it's gonna happen. It's yeah. in Ezekiel. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Hey, there was also um, an article going into how Israel already has war plans for Iran. They've been having war. Plans. If you have a plan, that means it's ready to execute. All right. That's why they go back to uh, uh, Ezekiel. Yeah. So it's back. Go, go, so uh, this is back in Ezekiel 7 and 26. It says, Mischief shall come upon mischief, and rumor shall be upon rumor. Then shall they seek a vision of the prophet, but the law shall perish from the priest. All right. When all these judgments take place, that's when our people don't want to seek for answers. They don't want to know. They don't want to know. They're going to want to know what's going on and how to be delivered from it. But by then, it's going to be too late, man. Yeah, there's going to be a a major famine of the word like it's prophesied in Amos 8. That's right. Yeah. Now go back to Matthew 24, where you left off. Matthew 24. In verse 6. And he shall hear of wars and rumors of wars. See that he be not troubled. So when these things are happening, when they're going to happen, when War III is happening, when War III is going to happen, they declare on the news that America is going to war with Russia, right? World War III is declared, we're not supposed to be troubled by it because that's our salvation. And we know that the Lord's doing that to judge these nations. Yep. All right, that's the beginning of their judgment. All right? It's, it's going to be hell, man. It's going to be yeah. It's going to be so much dead bodies that no body bags going to be sent back to, to either Russia, China. The, the, the soldier die, he's going to stay there, man, to be a feast unto the birds and, and, to, and, and, for, the, and for the elites to clean, to clean, to, uh, to dig up, to dig up, to dig up. And to clean clean up the mess that they made. Yeah, that continual employment. Yeah. yeah Go real, ahead. real quick, um, there was like a little debate on CNN, and the dude was like, "You saying talking about Russia so carelessly, like we trying to have a war with Russia? We talking about Russia, nuclear war, you know? And we, we not we not trouble." Right. You saying war with Russia? Uh huh. They yeah. want to have war with Russia? Did you see that movie? Uh, what that with Morris? Uh, oh, I gotta see, see that, that's bro. A good ass. Hey, I, I it's in the No, it's on Prime. But, um, go ahead. Be he not troubled, for all these things must come to pass, but the end is not yet. Go ahead. Right. Go ahead. And it says, for nations shall rise against nation, kingdom against kingdom. Yeah, you have a lot of tension between Russia and America. All right, where they're the same kingdom, right? But they're the same Edomite, because Russians are Edomites too. All right, but they're divided right now. Yeah. And you got tension between Esau and Jake. Yeah. All right, tensions are very high, man. Yeah. All right, go ahead. And there shall be famines and pestilences and earthquakes in diverse places. All these are the beginning of sorrow. Yeah, you see that right now. Famine of this, uh, the famine and famine of desolate. Famine, read that famine part again. It says, um, famines with an S and pestilences and earthquakes in diverse places. Right, and you see that right now, man. Right now the Lord's bringing us drought in the Colorado River. Which a lot of these farmers that, re that require that water is going to mm -hmm. suffer, man. Yeah. Okay? You got earthquakes in diverse places. You have a pestilence, right? Right? Which this pestilence, you know, this, you know, this COVID, which, you know, is just a common flu. All right? A real pestilence hasn't happened. 
Alright, we're in we're in the mask because of fucking Teslas. Alright? Because there was a study shown by the Stanford University, he saw tell you this, that the masks are not protecting you. Alright, they're not doing nothing to protect you from the virus or causing harm to you. Alright, but people don't know that, man. They just believe whatever they they just believe whatever the news the government tells them because they trust in the government so much. Alright, but skip down to 32. Verse 32. Now those are some of the signs the Lord told us to watch for. Okay? And we see we see those signs happening on earth right now, man. Okay, go ahead. Matthew 24 and 32. Now learn a parable of the fig tree. Mm. When it, his branch is yet tender and put it forth leaves, he know that summer is nigh. Right. Exactly. Same same goes with fall. When you see the uh the leaves yeah. fall from the trees or it becomes orange, right? In that fall weather, you know that you know you know that fall your fall season. Yeah. When you see first winter is when you see um same thing when it's same thing with snow. Alright, you know, you know when it starts to get cold, temperatures start to drop, the, uh, it gets darker earlier, that's how you know uh, you're, you're coming towards towards winter. Alright? Same thing with these signs. We start to see these signs happening, that's how you know we're getting close to the second coming of our Lord Yahweh Shai. Can we tell you a date? No, because we don't know. But we know that it's close, it can happen at any moment. It's gonna, it's gonna come as a thief in the night to a lot of people, but not to us, because we've been watching. So when all hell breaks loose, we're not gonna be bugging out like you people are about to, man. We're gonna, we're gonna be stable, because we have that knowledge, wisdom, and understanding that's gonna keep us stable, man. We don't know what to do. Because we've been, we've been preparing spiritually, all right, for, for, the, for the day of Jacob's trouble, for the day of the Lord's wrath. Yeah. Constantly praying every day that the Lord, he, that he delivers us from the wrath that he's gonna bring. All right, delivers us from the hour of temptation, deliver us from the persecution, deliver us from Jacob's trouble. That he gives us the spirit not to take the off of Egypt, that he gives us the spirit not to deny him or fold under pressure. All right, we, we constantly, us brothers, we constantly hope and, and have hope that the Lord has mercy upon us. That's why, we, that's why we're out here. All right, because not, not only are we out here to be watchmen and to warn our people, but we're trying to save ourselves. All right, we're trying to be in a good grace with y'all, but she y'all shy. Because I'm telling you, nobody, we don't want no problems, man. I don't want no problems with them Heavenly Father. None of us want no problems. No smoke with them Heavenly Father. We want no problems. Our hands are too short, man. Fuck, 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 so likewise he, when he shall see all these things, know that it is near, even at the doors. Yep, so we're seeing all these signs happening on the world. All right, we see it, okay? This is why we know that, it, that it's near, man. We can't give, like, again, we can't give you a date. Because yeah. in the same chapter it tells you that no man know at the time. Yeah. The father, no, uh, no man or angel, exactly. only the father knows. All right. We mentioned earlier about the watchman. Anytime there's a eclipse or a red moon or something that we know, those are signs that the Most High has given us. We don't look at that like some folly or nothing, man. It's like getting closer, man. Go ahead. Verse 34. Verily I say unto you, this generation shall not be passed till all these things be fulfilled. Man. That was it. Go back to, uh, you got a piece up? Uh, Second Ezra 2 and 27. Be not weary, for when the days of trouble and heaviness cometh, right. others of, shall weep. A lot of people, oh, go ahead, he's going to say it slow. And be sorrowful. Read that again, all over again. Um, Second Ezra 2 and 27. Be not weary, for when the days of trouble and heaviness cometh, others shall weep and be sorrowful, mm -hmm. but thou shalt be merry and have abundance. Right, a lot of you people that are not, we're not preparing spiritually, we're not showing any signs of repentance, not seeking the Lord, not getting yourself right. Yeah. When the Lord brings judgment upon this fucking country, a lot of y'all are gonna be in mourning and weak, man. All right, your, your children will be dashed in front of your eyes, your wives will be ravished. All right, your, your, all your riches are not gonna be able to save you because, you know, with this, with the pandemic, got a lot of people that had money that their riches were able to save them. You know, they weren't going through losing their jobs, losing their homes, losing their business because they had money. But what's coming this time, your riches are not going to save you, all right? Your riches are not going to be able to deliver you from the day of the Lord's bad, man. All right, all you celebrities, all you jakes that sold out, 
all that, all them riches that you flaunt, not gonna save you, man. All right. I asked a lot of Edomites to come in, you know, at work, and nothing happened to them during the pandemic. Only thing that happened was they had to stay home. They didn't go through uh, losing a job, losing money, no, no type of distress. Yep. But That's now right. the Lord is gonna visit them like yep. a thief in the night. Okay, they do They had these people. They do it carelessly, man. Yep. Living, living in fancy houses, having no worries in the world, bills paid, car paid, to pay. You know, not have to worry about no car pimp, not have to worry about nothing, because they got they got the money. Yeah. But real soon, man, your worries and all that's gonna come to naught, man. Or right, you're gonna have to suffer. Or right, you're gonna feel the Lord's wrath, man. Alright, because hey, this is the reason why this is gonna happen here, because it's mainly for Jake. But these other nations, these other Edomites, it's gonna happen too, because the wicked elite, they don't give a fuck about their own people. They only care about the rich. Exactly. They don't care about their own people. That's, yeah, that's this is why this is why you see a homeless Edomites, man. Exactly. All right, because yeah. they cared about their own people. They won't be no fuck homeless Edomites. Yeah. They only be they only be homeless Jake, man. Yeah. But there's homeless Edomites. You got Edomites that are losing. Edomites yeah. that are, are suffering. Yeah. Are, are, are finally catching, well, feeling, yeah, yeah. feeling, uh, catching hell. Like Jake, yeah. like Jake is. They okay? bugging out. They talking about uh, we take, uh, they're taking over. They feeling like that because they they falling as a people, man. You got you got certain Edomites to not. You got certain of myself have lost their business. You got certain of myself have lost their house. And, all right, because of this uh, yeah. pandemic. They blow their brains out. All right. <laughs> yep. They either blow their brains out or they take their guns out to the to yeah. the to the fucking to the government. All right. Yeah. And, and, and protest, man. Okay. Well, yeah. a lot of them are living in those. Um, that this selling their houses and living in those uh, vehicles. Those right. Mobile homes. Hey, but just like uh, in the curses, when the Lord uh, uh, cursed Jake. Not keeping the laws. All right, when the Lord put those curses, it didn't happen all at once. It happened throughout a period of time. All right, and the Lord's putting these, taking the curses off us and putting these other nations. That's, right. that's what you see right now. It's happening. Yeah. The Lord's putting certain curses upon these, uh, upon 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 Esau, man. And these other nations, they're feeling it, man. And, and okay. The scripture do say that's a complaint of an ungodly father, like uh, this Edomite or this Elamite that I work with. He finally got treated like a Jake. Now he's all sympathizing, like. There's no reason for the cop to pull you over and chase oh. you and harass you. Examples with the uh, Moabites, man, the Asians. They finally know what it's like to be treated like Jake. Yeah. yeah. And look what they're doing. They're passing laws to protect them. Yeah, exactly. Uh, and hey, yeah. hey, they, hey, they haven't, ever since this virus happened, they started getting treated like shit, the Asians. Yeah. And they passed laws. And here it is, Jake, being treated like shit this whole time. Yeah. They don't pass laws to protect us. All right? Because they don't give a fuck about us, man. All right, here it is. You Jake's voted for Biden, All right? Joe Biden. He's biting you. All right, yeah. he's your, he's your savior, but he ain't protecting you, man. Hey, ever since he came in office, cops been killing even more Jake, man. He's supposed to be for your cause, right? Our people are trusting in the wrong, in, in the wrong one, man. They're trusting in the enemy. The Bible says, not, never trust that enemy, no matter how he speaks to you, man. Because right now he seems. When he, when he gave everyone a 1400, everyone on, all Jake on social media was all happy, call, calling yeah. him Joe Button. Yeah. All right, not knowing not knowing that this man is deceiving you. Yeah. He's not for your cause. A gift. This yep, a gift destroyed the heart, yep. and their heart, their mind, our people's mind destroyed over over what 1400. What the fuck is that? Yeah, shit. I already spent my 1400. Yeah. All right, it should go by fast. 1400 is like rent, man. Well, it depends where you live, in Cali. You need like a couple more hundreds just to fucking afford goddamn rent in this goddamn place. Yeah. Okay, go ahead. Others shall weep and be sorrowful. Right, others, are, and right now we're about to witness others are gonna weep and be sorrowful. Alright, because because at the time of our weeping, because right now we're, men and Lord, we're in the house of mourning. You people are in the house of laughter, house of joy, yeah. laughing at us, scoffing at us. Uh, but the time is coming where you're about, you're about to be sorrowful. Yeah. You're about to mourn. Exactly. All right, we're going to laugh at you. Yeah. Hey, that's balanced too, because they've been laughing at our suffering. That Lord's about to laugh at your yeah. suffering. Yeah, they think, they see, uh, like, yeah, family members that may know you're in the truth. So, well, the Lord's with you. Why are you, why are you going through that? Why are you catching hell? You know, why are you, why, 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 you know, why, why are you always, why is all, bad things always happen to you? Because I'm being chastised for the Lord. I'm being put through the fire. Yeah. You don't understand. Yeah. Shit. Yeah. Verse 28, then heathen shall envy thee, 
but they shall be able to do nothing against Why? Them, Why are they getting envious? The because we're going to be in the kingdom and we're going to have everything. Yeah. And gonna, we're not going to do anything to us because we're going to be gods. We're going to yeah. have spiritual power, man. Yeah. Yeah. We don't want no smoke with no God. Yeah. All right? We're the sons of God. We're the yeah. sons, of, sons of the heavenly father and the son. All right? The Lord's yeah. going to turn us up and these nations, they're going to envy us. Here it is right now. You see Jake. You see how they're living. We envy them. We kind of envy comes into your mind, but Psalm 37, this says, for not and be envious of the wicked yeah. or, or how they prosper or, yeah. or of their ways. Yeah. All right, because man, I went to a uh, this other place I went to, I was I was working in. Man, I never seen a nice the, the houses like because there was another one. You remember I told you about the Reseda one? Yeah, yeah, I found something better now. Oh, you did that shit. That house, them houses, man, are fucking huge, bro. Roads paved clearly, it's quiet as hell. Them houses are nice. Damn, I'm like, damn, these people are living like this? Yeah. God damn. What the fuck, fuck y'all do to look? You know? Yeah. But but it, that's nothing compared to what we're going to receive. That's, trash. that's like living in a uh, like garbage can. Yeah. yeah. All right? Over there. It's yeah. like living on the street yeah. compared to what we're about to receive. Y'all yeah, exactly. receive little fucking mansions, right? Or little castles, right? You pay property tax and all that. We're going to receive a whole fucking planet. Yeah. Yeah. The and galaxies. some. Yep, and some. All right. I said in my father's house, is good. Many mentions. We're going to have riches that we don't know what to do with. Yeah. Uh -huh. All right. It's like, shit. Yeah, you know. They always be like, welcome to my mansion. Uh, in my, in my got, house or something. Yeah, they got MTV cribs. Remember that? Yep. What the fuck? It's, hey, man. It's going to be man. You, uh -huh. day the Lord, the day the Lord uh, gives you, if you're of his elect, yep. the day the Lord gives us his, um, gives you his, uh, give you uh, your planet, it's gonna take you years to explore what's in it. Yeah. There's gonna be new things, new creatures, new colors, new, new smell, yeah. new foods. Like, damn! You're gonna have virgin women, oh, yeah, that's big. beautiful, top notch, cocky, yeah. and all that, you're gonna, man. You're gonna fly in the galaxies, man. Yeah, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You're gonna fly what you want, be in the chariot. Yeah. No fucking worries. Yeah. All right, no fucking worries at all. It's just like in this world, where you're constantly worrying about how you're gonna pay your bill yeah. or about Esau. You know, catching the case with Esau and shit, dealing with baby mama drama and all that. All that's gonna come to naught, man. Right. All right. And, and even if you don't stress about it, it's still in your mind. You might have a court date a year later in the future, but it's still in your mind and clogging up your 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 your, your time and your mental thinking, man. Because well, yeah. you know you gotta make that. But I wanted to mention the video about the Eda. I don't know if y'all seen it. Eda Mike, she is like talking to her own people. Saying you you need to repent what, what you done to your own uh, what you done to the Israelites the so called Black and Latino Native American you have to <laughs> Esau feeling it man yeah hey but, the but they they the wicked shall not go in punishment they're not gonna repent they're not gonna repent either it's too you know? late it's too late hey that's why you have uh, uh the children shall seek to please uh, yeah yeah uh, please the poor yeah, yeah. all right you got Edom I said partaking in this Black Lives Matter protest, acting like they care, yeah. you know, thinking they're doing something right. They're just seeking to, they're just seeking to uh, yes. please the poor yeah. for for the for the sins that their forefathers have done. Mm -hmm. All right, go ahead. They feel that guilt, that shame, like the brother said. Yeah. Right, and you're gonna feel, feel it more in the kingdom of heaven, man. Yeah. Yeah. You get when you get when you're getting uh, when you're getting whipped, man, just like Jake. Yeah. Getting 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 attacked by animals, just like how you did us. Yeah. Yeah. Con, con, yeah, that, that's important to remember because uh, right now they're feeling guilt. They, they they want mercy, but they don't remember what they did in their past. Life. Yeah, they you said know? no mercy is gonna be shown. No mercy. Yeah. That them that didn't have mercy. Yeah, I don't give a fuck if I have an Edomite slave and I had him. I knew him in this world. He uh he, he did something nice. Like last time, uh, I was in Simi Valley. And that's like an Edomite area, and I thought I had money in my card and shit. And uh, I went to the card. I went swipe. Like, oh shit, declined. Oh, what the fuck? Just took all my money out. Edomite paid for my meal. Oh, wow. uh, in the kingdom of heaven, I'm gonna beat the shit out of him. He's an Edomite. Give a yeah, fuck. Exactly. Oh, yeah. uh, the Lord just used your ass to, to feed exactly. me. Exactly. Exactly. Yeah. Uh, and in the kingdom, I'm gonna whoop your ass. I'm not gonna uh, spare one goddamn slash because, you know? Exactly. Because you could have you could have had me as a slave. And exactly. Fucking, you yeah, tortured you, me in, your, in, in, in my past life. Yeah. I don't know. You could, have, you could have done some sh evil shit, man. Yeah. Right, we're not just gonna judge you off this life. Yeah. Uh, we're, we're gonna know what you did in all your fucking lives. 
Yeah, it's, it's, right. it said uh, even even your enemy should be at peace with you. That don't mean that they're not your enemy. It said your enemy. Oh, that's right. So yeah. you're still an enemy. Yeah. No matter what you how how you help, it's the Most High that put the spirit on you to help us. Yep, that's right. That's like right. Because we please the Most High. Yeah, man. Go ahead. But they shall be able to do nothing against thee, said the Lord. Because yeah, again, we're gonna be gods, man. But why don't Jake look at it like that? Why don't you? You, you know, Esau, why don't you be those special people, uh, some good Edomites? No, Most High put the spirit on them to be good towards you because you're the, you the, uh, his people. All right. Why are you giving Esau that credit that he is a righteous man just because he do that to Just because he's nice. Yeah, just because he's nice, man. Sometimes these devils are nice because they want to use you, man. Use you, yeah. Mm -hmm. Or just like it says in Surah 12, yeah, yeah. He'll, he'll, he'll humble himself exactly. to see like he, until he gets what he wants exactly. from you, man. Yeah. And when he gets what he wants, that's when he shows himself. Yep. All right, because I don't understand. I see Jake. There's a story on um, how this one uh, Jake got killed by his eight of my friends. All right? And like, I'm like, were you supposed to feel bad for him? Why the fuck are you hanging out with Edomites? They're the devil. Yeah. Just because they're cool with you now, man, the devil will come out of them, man. I'm telling you from experience. Yeah. All right, you could be cool with Esau, but the devil's going to come out of them. All right? Yeah. All, you, all, you, all you Jake's hanging out with Esau to have an Edomite best friend, hey, guess what? When all hell breaks loose, when nation is rising against nation, kingdom against kingdom, uproars of the people, the devil is gonna come out of it, man. Yeah. Oh, you fucking black woman, yeah. you Eve, that are with the serpent oh, yeah. right now, oh, you gonna shit. the devil is gonna come out of them, that's man. Right. Right? That's right. That's gonna come out of your husband. Yeah. Don't show the true horns. Yeah. That's how you know this pro Most High program it said before Esau and Jacob did any evil or good. So he just because he didn't do evil yet, that don't mean he wasn't created to be the wicked man. Right. You know, he's still going to operate as a wicked because that's the, what the Most High's role will for him, man. To until uh, he get taken out, man. It's going to be that way till he goes into slavery and then be no more after that, man. So you can't save him, man, or make him right. It says, you know? it says in Isaiah 58 that the wicked are estranged from the womb. Ooh, man. They go astray as soon as they be born, speaking yeah. lies. They like a oh, well, fucking uh, 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 may say it's just a it's just a, it's just a baby right yeah. but you got a you got a you got a rattlesnake a rattlesnake <laughs> yeah. you got the baby. Just baby oh it's just the baby movie you know that the babies no. are more venom than the parents yeah. go 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 play with yourself a baby rattlesnake that's gonna bite you yeah all right then you gotta kick the baby and shit like oh shit the baby bite you your reaction is to kick the baby and shit you don't, you don't even think hey. of him as a baby no more you got you got jake that that's trying to be cool with esau right Best friends. Oh, well, he's nice to me, right? Well, it's like it's like, kind of like a it's like you have a, a line, right? Or you have a like a cup line, right? A line cup. Oh, the the uh, video will start recording. Oh, uh, it's full. But just like how you have a line cup, right? If you have a line cup. Eventually, it goes yeah, into an adult line, right? And eventually, its instinct starts coming in. Yeah. All right. So you may have an Edomite friend, he's your best friend, but this man is made to be your enemy. He's made yeah. to be the wicked. Right. And this instinct, what he's made for, is going to come out of him. Yeah. All right? Yeah. So go ahead. And it says, um, My hand shall cover thee so that thy children shall not see hell. Mm. All right, that was it. You got any closing scriptures? Uh, if you want to get that in Isaiah 65. Uh, go, says, go, uh, I'll go back to uh, let's go back to Isaiah, 2nd of 9. Oh, okay. Hey, bro, your phone uh, died, it, died again. No, it's uh, full. Yeah, it has no storage. It's full. Huh? There's no storage in there. says then shalt thou well understand that the most I spake of those things from the days that were before thee. Yeah, when you see prophecies happening, damn, the Lord said this is gonna happen. Yeah. When you see World War III, oh wow, the Lord said that this is gonna happen. Yeah. When you see the mark of the beast, damn, the Lord said this was gonna happen. Yeah. When you see Esau bringing this mark of the beast and make a mandatory, so much to say, damn, the Lord said that, that this was gonna happen. Hey, like, when you say when you see earthquakes in diverse places, damn, the Lord said that this was gonna happen. Yeah. We see when you hear about Russia invading this fucking place, yeah. the foreign troops. The Lord said that this is gonna happen. Yeah. Neighbor against neighbor. All right. You, when, when the prophecies start to happen, these different plays that we're about to witness, these, these scriptures are gonna come into our mind. 
All right, they're gonna they're gonna come into my our, our mind. We're gonna know. Like, Damn, the Lord said that this is gonna happen. Because before the Lord does things, He always tells you. Just like we brought out yeah. Nazir, 42 and yeah. 46. The He's 46 a righteous power. Go ahead. Yeah, Are you smiling, bro? No, it's just uh, It says. Uh, the best with you? Then shalt thou well understand that the Most High spake of those things from the days that were before thee. Right, because everything is already uh, planned out, man. Yeah. All right, the Lord already has everything planned out. Yeah. Nothing goes without a say so, yeah. man, because everything is planned out. Exactly. Okay. How did he speak to his prophets? You don't want to speak to the Most High, man. Hey, that's why there's no room for pride. Like you had a king up. Like, Shh, I don't know. Yeah. If you read Isaiah, Isaiah 37, or uh, you go into uh, King Hezekiah, the time of Syria, what's that guy's name? Shinnika. Uh, his name is kind of hard to say. 37 or 36. I'll get his name real quick. Uh, yeah, Sina, Sina Cheribs. Sina Cheribs. Yeah, I saw it. It's kind of you know tongue twister, but he was boasting on how he took over other, other, uh, other these other nations down, and their gods wouldn't be able to save him. So he was trying to convince Jake, hey, don't go, don't trust in the Most High. Or don't trust in, don't, who are you going to go to? You're going to go to Egypt, you're going to go to, you go to your Lord, you go to the Most High, you're going to go to your God. Look what I did to these other nations' gods. He was prideful, all right? He was boasting how he took these other nations' gods. You know what the Lord told his ass? The Lord said, hey, you know, to you know, paraphrase it, he said, I'm the one that planned for you to do that. I planned for you to take down these other nations. And, and for their gods, there were no gods. I'm the, the Lord's the only God out there. Yeah. Yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai. Yeah. Okay? Alright, you can read it. You can read the whole story in uh this uh as the other 36 chapters in the Chronicles as well. Mm -hmm. You know, how he was boasting. Alright, but the reason why I bring that out is to prove that the Lord he already has everything planned out. Yeah. Alright, this yeah, place man. he already he already had the place. He had exactly. it prophesied for uh, for Esau to take this take this country from the Native Americans, yeah, Central Indians, exactly. and, 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 and the Mexicans. Yeah. Okay? What? He already planned it out. That's why he told him, uh, through the spirit of Joseph, no, uh, Jacob, he told, he was breaking down the tribes. When he said, when he came to Gad, he said, Gad, you're a troop, but the troop's going to overcome him. Yeah. All right? But, but he shall overcome at the last. Exactly. Yeah. He told Moses, go to Pharaoh. He said, even though you tell him, he ain't going to listen because I'm going to put it in his heart not to listen, man. Right. Why did the Lord do that? To glorify His name, to show His power. Show His power. All right. Yeah. So the same thing's going on right now. Esau, he don't want to let us go. He don't want to teach us. He don't want to let us know who we are. All right. The Lord's doing that, man. The Lord's gonna cause Esau to come with a great man. All right. So He can show His power. All right. Because yeah. He's gonna destroy this place in one hour. Mm -hmm. Think about it. Look how long it took this place to be built up. Yeah. By the blood of the Israelites, by the way. All right? Yeah. But this place is going to be taken down in one hour yeah. by the ultimate Israelite. Yeah, we're going to say, uh, by Shimei, I was shot. so great riches come to not, it should be taken down in one hour. Man. That's right. <laughs> Real quick. Daniel 4 and 17. This matter is by the decree of the watchers. Yeah. And the, demanded, the, the demand by the word of the holy ones to the intent that the living may know that the most high ruleth in the kingdom of men right. and give it to whomsoever he will and set it up over it the basis of men. He said the same thing to Moses. So you know? you saw you're not really in control. Yeah. Even though you think you got it in all, all control. Yeah. No, it's Lord, he's in control. Yeah, yeah. yeah. All right, the power that you have it was given to you by the Lord. The Lord gave you that power. He gave it us what he blessed you with it. He the right. basis of men. He yep. Yeah, yeah. So the fucking white man was living in the goddamn caves. Yeah. Alright? Yeah. Not knowing, not knowing, not knowing how to speak. Exactly. Eating right. juniper roots. How right. You know? Exactly. You know, barely know how to start a fucking fire. The Lord took those men out of their weakest state. Exactly. Out of the confused state that they're in. Uh -huh. And brought them to rule the world as today and they rule it through their sword. Exactly. How All you right? gonna be the uh Yeah. <laughs> how you gonna be the outcast, the lepers, and there's dark nations, and you rise above the dark nations? It's always been racism between the dark nations and Esau. Right. So why, how you get ahead of everything? A uh, China, ahead of the Elamites, so-called uh, East Indians, uh, uh, the uh, head of Ham and all that. Most High put you there, man. Yep. You know? Most High rule is in the kingdom of men. Yep. He set up over it 
the basis of men. Okay, and you know Esau is base, man, because it's nothing that he won't do. He don't have a conscience. He'll do anything, man. David said he wouldn't have his him them sleep among his flock, his dogs, man. Hey, you know how it says, uh, before they speak forth, I tell you of them, right? Mm -hmm. The Lord, he told, uh, he, he gave a dream to Nebuchadnezzar, right? Of all the nations that, that was going to rule, all right, before, before, uh, before um, Israel, right? You had the Syrian Empire, you had the Babylonian Empire, you had the Medes and the Persian Empire, right? Then you had the Greek and the Roman Empire. And then out of that, you had the, uh, come, you had the, the, the Weak, you got EU, NATO, all right, and then you had a, like it says in Daniel, the second chapter, all right, you had the head of gold, which represents the Babylonians, the silver, which represents the uh, Medes and the Persians, uh, the bronze, which represents the uh, Greeks, and then uh, uh, the iron, which represents the Romans. Then you had the toes, uh, mixed with iron and clay, the weak, you had the weak and strong EU nations, all right, and then, then, then there was a stone. A great millstone, a great mighty stone, which represents Yahweh Shai, that broke down the whole statue. Man, yeah. All right, and established his kingdom. Man. All right, and the kingdom is being established. The Lord's kingdom is being established right now. Why I say that? Because the Lord's men are here. And That's the kingdom right. is, is within us, man. That's crazy because okay. I uh, uh, like it, but it said that all these uh, God, uh, all the gods of the nations are idols. Right. That statue is kind of like an idol that the Most High is going to destroy all right. them, all that comprise of that those nations. Right, that's right. Of their gods, man. Right. Because right, real soon, everybody, every single soul on earth is going to know that Yahweh, wa, which means and Yahweh Shai, Yahweh Bahashim Yahweh Shai, is the only God right. out there. Yep. There's no other God besides Him. That's right. All yeah. right. We're going to learn. When the Lord brings his great wrath, because it says in the scriptures that when the Lord brings his war, that these nations are going to know that it's from the Holy One of Israel. When the Lord uh, delivers his elect, the nations are going to know that we were under them because the Lord was using them to punish us. Yeah. Okay? Yeah. So don't 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 get don't get so far up with pride, you fucking old by thinking that you're the next one to rule. We're the next one to rule because Hey, Yahweh Shah is that stone that took down all the yep. nations. Moabites already had your time to rule. Exactly. All right? Exactly. So, with that, we want to give low and your brothers edified. Low one, we out here next week. We want to give all praises, honor, and glory to Yahweh Shah, Yahweh Shah, Shalom. 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 Damn, bro, that was